Peekaboo. Hello. How are you doing? <laughs> it power style. <laughs> it power intro. Hi. Hi, yeah. what's your name, Mandy? <laughs> <laughs> we should talk about, uh, what do you call it? Pervy slug bug. Oh, we'll get to that one. But uh, let me tell you, you know, our dancing friend, the uh, one who's married to the Proven, or was, uh, and they're working on divorce, they had this house <clears throat> in college area, mm -hmm. paying one sixteen hundred a month. Uh -huh. And they wanted to rent out the garage, but they spent 50K making it into this kind of thing they could have easily done for a rental or an Airbnb. Uh -huh. So make a long story short, they want to separate. So she moves out. He's in the house. But he sells the house. They sell the house. Mm -hmm. Now they're renting a place for thirteen hundred dollars, and they're they're living together. So and so I mean, what was the fish, point? Yeah, we could say they could have been living their scar, or at least someone lived there. It's just stupid people, man. Yeah, I know. We we heard about that one because I said if they're living in their car, because they've talked about we want to downsize. And mind you, their house isn't that big. How these you want to go live in a boat. That's what I was thinking. If I said, if I hear they're living in an actually small house or out of the back of their car because they're so damn cheap. Mm -hmm. Then I tell you, they came to Thanksgiving and I thought they brought like this half because he don't, he don't drink whiskey, right? Mm -hmm. Bourbon. So he brings bourbon. He brings all this whatever bottles and shit. And yeah, you could have uh, the, the whiskey. So I'm touching it a little bit. And he's drinking our white Russians because we had that. And, of course, we're splurging on that. At the end of the night, all right, thanks for everything. You know, give him a plate to go. He says, oh, yeah, I got to grab my booze and shit. And I was like, oh, shit. I said, oh, my God. I'm sitting there watching TV. He's taking the fucking whiskey. <laughs> it was empty. And like, you know, half. You know, drink it. And it was. <laughs> and I said, wow. <laughs> when I first met these cats, mm -hmm. we went to Brad, uh, get the hell out of a there. Japanese... <laughs> Um, yakitori kind of place. Uh -huh. They order a bottle of soju, right? And you know, I'm you know I don't like to drink and drive, mm -hmm. so I have like two, right? And I said a little much, but I just met the fish woman and shit. Oh, yeah, and so you to make nice with her. Friends. Yeah, they said we should order one in a bottle, you know, of soju. At the end of the night, they fucking pack up the soju, and bring not even asked me, and it's uh -huh. like Jesus. He had more than that, and I, he doesn't even like offer or right. whatever. That's these people. I always had a bad, thing. but they, you know, they're they're living in theirs. So are they? Are they going to live in a van or? No, they're renting a place for thirteen hundred dollars. Okay. They're still debating. They're seeing a counselor, which we think they're probably paying money for that. And it's like, oh, they, they could have just stayed in the house. Yeah, they could have just stayed in the house. That sounds pretty stupid, dude. I mean, if you really want to downsize, like I said, move into a boat or buy an RV or. Or a just, large van or something. Or rent out a room. Or rent the room. In a, you know, though, I, I think I, me personally, I'd rather live in a van than rent a room out of some places, some person's house. Well, that was me. Yeah. With the boat. Yeah. I'm going to the same, you know, I like my privacy. You like your space. Yeah. Even if it's just like, you know, it's not connected. Yeah. So, that's them. Now we can talk about... Uh, Pervy Slug Bug. Pervy Slug Bug. The fish <laughs> this weekend was um, at the Long Beach Grand Prix. A lot of pretty girls. And we, I was talking with Corn, like, you know, am I the only ones who have these kind of thoughts or playing these games? Like, you know, I'm a, an adult here. But it, it was this game I was doing, like, Slug Bug, you know, a game that second graders would play. But I'm looking for, like, beautiful girls. And it's like, I'm going to hold my breath until I see the next hot girl that I like, you no, know? No, 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 no. That's not how you said it. I know, but That's I'm not getting, how you said it. I try to be discreet. Let's be honest about how you said it. Yeah. Like, Which is, there's nothing wrong with that. Bums, I think the same things. The the female bum that I would lick. Whose asshole you would lick. <laughs> yes. Yes. Like, literally. And there are some, there are some nice buns there, dude. Nice buns. Yeah, see, when it comes to that kind of thing for me, though, I'd have to... I have to smell them. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it doesn't pass the smell test. I'm not going to get licked. Do you, I'm going to tell you something. Do you remember um, during the race when I was doing this game, I remember like the only person, like who could get away with this shit? Because you hear about Donald, you know, you uh -huh. could, 
talking yeah, like that. You know, you grab them in the pussy. Mm. But then you, who did it for real is like, what's that movie about Uday Hussein? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Where he's at the nightclub and he's like taking girls fucking tops off. Their boyfriends are clapping because, you know, they don't want to get killed. They get to go along with the game. You know what I don't get about that is, why don't you just kill him? Who killed, you mean, the, the son? Yeah. Well, that was that weird regime. I mean, you sure you do a service for everybody, but you yourself are going to die. So what? They were in the nightclubs. So I think they just wanted a party. I don't know, dude. I mean, I'm, I'm just, you know, glad, you know, we don't have anybody. Well, I don't no, know. No, we do. We have, <laughs> I was about to say, hope we don't have anybody in our neck of the woods doing it. What we do. Yeah, you hear about crime like that here in mm-hmm. stateside, so... I guess people just do their own little whatever. I mean, people abusing, trafficking, kidnapping. It's there. Doing, yeah, you're right. It's there. It's just not it's as just blatant. just not looking at it all the time, but it's there. It's pretty crazy. But anyway, we got the, um, our guests here. We're kind of happy. So how long did you hold your breath at any one period of time? Uh, there's the one where you needed to grab because, you know, you tried to, oh, that wasn't it. That wasn't <laughs> it. Oh. Did you look around? Yeah, you're looking like, you know, it's a game. You can breathe, but you try to be honest to the game. You right, know, like, right. you know, a bona fide slug bug. You want a bona fide, like, you know, you know, a bona fide bone bum that you would... That you would look at. <laughs> yeah. uh, there's, a, there's a couple of them. It wasn't long that you had to hold your breath, though. Uh-huh. It wasn't long. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I think... Uh... I'd pass it out a couple of times. Well, you think the... No, there's a lot of girls there, Corn. A lot yeah. of girls. A lot of girls that crossed the red Top line. shelf? Top shelf. Across the board? And I'm not talking, oh, yeah. nine here before there. Or the... No, no, no. Top shelf across the board. You know that girl we saw at the Chick-fil-A? Yeah, that's not... Like, that's, that, nowhere that the, that's nowhere in the realm. Because there's the general population. Yeah, see, that's nowhere in the realm for me. I mean, if I'm going to do that... It would have to be top shelf. Yeah. But you can admire the lesser shelf, right? Yeah, but I'm not going to lick her asshole. Uh, okay, I get, I get you. No, mine was bona fide lick the butt. Maybe my, you know, because I guess that's, you know, you just... Uh, you have different standards, I guess. <laughs> yeah. You know, it's like... Like I said, it's, it's, it's got to pass the smell yeah. test to boot. It can't just be easy on the eyes. It's got to pass the smell test. It's, um... And I got to really like her. <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. But it's, I think it's like sports and Olympic. You dif- dif- different different sport. Yeah, yeah. Because you know you probably have a different you know, you know archery. Fetish. Maybe, yeah, <laughs> different fetish that you're an expert at. I mean, <laughs> you know. I was telling my wife about that the other day that uh, you know I, my bitch fetish. Yeah. And she does, she does not understand that you know to me, I love winding up a chick, getting her pissed off at me. Just being she angry. couldn't understand that. She doesn't get it. You know, we all, we all know it, like, that it's all about the hunt. And you want to, you know, a bore at you, you know, you're just kind of, you know, wheeling your knife at it and you know, it could attack you. You know what I mean? She, I mean, she's just like flabbergasted by it. And, and to her credit, she's a very nice, decent woman. Yeah, same with the, the fishes woman. Same <laughs> decent woman. But why did she end up with me? Beyond me. Yeah, but I think that's what gives the thing. Maybe it's not as co- it's more common than we think because we're not doing weird some of those weird atrocities. Yeah, that's true. You we're know not what I mean? chopping up people and putting them in boxes or doing wacky shit. I think to thinking well, about it, it depends what you mean by wacky shit. I mean, yeah. well, you read the you read the magazines. Girls will allude to a sexy time, and it'll be like on Glamour magazine. Does your man like to do that? And it's like you read the oh. article, and so oh, he's talking about you know they'll have a fancy illustration in the corner, and then it starts off with the text, and it's like they'd be it would talk about licking butt. And it'd be so like a rose in the just cup. talking about fucking tossing somebody's salad. Why, why dress it up, man? I mean, just... they trying to dress it up because it's, you know, they had the little illustration with the, with like a rose in the butt. You know what I mean? <laughs> the, you know yeah, what I'm saying? The, the stylized yeah, drawing. The and stylized it's... drawing and, and you, you, yeah, no, it's pointless. Just call it what it is, dude. And I think they talk about the smell as like being the aroma. Does your woman have, do you have the right aroma? 
<laughs> Don't eat carne asada tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Unless that's your thing, guys. That's the thing, dude. <laughs> Don't eat carne asada. I know, just eat mango. Just eat the beans, bitch. <laughs> I know. You know, I wonder if that's more true. bananas. I know you, you like if you're a, like a chronic butt licker, <laughs> and like you know, like sometimes when you eat a hot salsa, uh huh, and you use uh, go number two, uh huh, you have oh that so warm. <laughs> like you know, that's that's a good question. If there's any real scat aficionados out there, uh, please feel <laughs> free to chime in. I know the viewer number two is like, whoa, jeez, scat. <laughs> They speak volumes to me. <laughs> Did somebody say scat? <laughs> we speak volumes to people. <laughs> uh, we speak volumes to these three people that just fucking are just into our shit. That's hilarious. Uh, because, you know, sometimes we talk about popular places. We're in good old San Diego. A lot of people might think this is their summer vacation. Yeah. It's the much better version because we showed you the view outside... This very house, door. Yeah, outside the studios. Yeah, studios. Oh, that's right, Corn. Uh, if you want to buy our syndication, <laughs> you will take a carton of cigarettes and a keg of beer. A keg of Tecate beer. But it's got to have the tap. No deal without the tap. What if the stipulations, Corn, was that some guy said, I hate you guys. I want you off here. Will that count as you don't do any more fishing corn? You come back as another entity, but you kill fishing corn for a pack of cigarettes, a carton of cigarettes, and a, and a, and a fucking... Sure. And then we, we come back the following time as Pez Maiz. Yes, that's right. Ooh, what's the fish again? Pez. 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 Oh, that's right. Pez. Like, like you know, P-E-C. Yes, pescatarian. Pescatarian. Uh, yeah, and we'll, we'll still be ass eaters on this show. <laughs> I know. See that rose? But oh, that's why they. I've seen the, the actual really photo. The photo on that drawing, like, does your man like to toss your salad? And toss that's why salad. it's a rosebud because they call it the butthole. Like on like Ed Powers. Oh, you have a very beautiful rosebud. Beautiful. Oh, look at that. Oh, Ed, that is nice. You know his wife. She's the cutie. It's all like that was pink. So creepy, dude. <laughs> and he did smell. He did the smell test. He had an ugly thing. Uh, <laughs> Anyways, we'll be back, maybe not. 